I'm Sam Burke, Corporate Chef for Meat and Livestock Australia. To me, there's no better sharing dish than a lamb shoulder. I've got free lamb oyster cut shoulders here today and we're going to do a slow roast with an Asian master stock. First thing we're going to do is lightly cover our lamb shoulders just with some canola oil. I'm going to saute off some vegetables just for those lamb shoulders to nestle on while they're cooking. Onion, spring onions, celery. And we want to make sure that we caramelise these vegetables nice and golden. Okay, we've got some colour of our vegetables now. We'll transfer these vegetables to our gastronome tray. We'll return our pan to the heat, make sure it gets smoking hot again. Now we'll add our lamb shoulder to the pan, skin side down. And we want to make sure we get nice caramelisation on our lamb shoulder. And we'll turn our shoulder over and repeat the process. And now we're going to make our master stock to accompany our lamb shoulder. Oil straight into the pan, fresh garlic straight in, ginger, and then straight in with our shallot, coriander, followed by our cinnamon quills and star anise. And then we want to get a nice caramelisation on these vegetables and these aromatics, because these will provide the real flavour for our master stock. We'll deglaze it with some Shaoxing wine. followed by a dark soy and then last of all some dark brown sugar for our sweetness and that'll become the stock that we slow roast our lamb shoulders in. Okay so now we've got a nice simmer of our master stock it's time to place this stock onto our lamb shoulders and then our lamb shoulders into the oven and then foil and now we'll place our lamb shoulders into the oven for a slow roast at 90 degrees for 10 hours. 30% steam, 70% dry heat. Now I'm going to transfer the lamb shoulder over to the other gastro tray. I've got my stock here and I'm going to transfer that through a chinois into a pot to reduce to the glaze. Okay, we've got our glaze now and what we're going to do is glaze our lamb shoulders and then place them back in the oven. And here's the end result. I'm sure you'd be happy with this. And there you have it. Slow roasted Asian lamb shoulder.